Hello guys, you probably know who I am. If you don't, I'm Foxidian. And today, I will be testing out if Ibis Paintex or Procreate are better for me. This is, of course, all based on my own opinions, and I'm not forcing you or anyone watching to use any programs. Right now, I am sketching a little thing in the notes app, so that I can use this as reference. I will be polishing this more when I finally start drawing. Right, now I would go into Ibis Paint X first. First, I made the sketch clearer and tried out new brushes I downloaded. It was really hard to choose, but in the end, it didn't matter because I used them all a little. The line you are seeing in the middle is where I will split the drawing. So Ibis Paint X on the right, Procreate on the left. I forgot my artist glove and accidentally drew dark with my hand the whole time, so I went and got the glove really quickly. When I first went into the APP, I skipped all tutorials and tips, as IP already used this APP and know what I'm doing. Sorry for the weird cuts and formatting by the way, I wasn't able to record it all and lost a bunch of footage from the initial speed paint, so I had to screen record the automatic speed paint. Plus, there were a bunch of ads and I didn't want to show those so this format will have to do. Hope y'all don't mind. Here is the footage I was able to save. I tried to put them in the right order. I feel like these types of recording are more fun to watch than the previous because the screen moves more and you know exactly where the artist is working. But I don't know. Anyways, this was really fun to work on. I haven't properly used Ibis Paint X in ages. Only on my phone when I'm bored or don't have anything else to do. Also, you probably noticed that this does not look like my usual animations at all. That is because my animation and art styles are very different from each other. I just find that it's much easier to have a less detailed style for animation and a detail for actual art. Plus, I haven't uploaded in ages and I've been improving and changing my art and styles constantly. Also can I just say that shading metal is incredibly hard, and I'm very impressed by anyone that manages to do it at all. Like just look at these, they do not look like metal whatsoever. I am editing this as I go, and I haven't started the other half yet. Also, there is no music playing so it is very awkward. This is what I hear iron. Only me and the text to speech man. And kit. Kit is my kitten by the way. Here are some pictures of him. I sent he he adorable. This is awkward. Here is your music again. I hope the talking I sent he to distracting from the speed paint. It took me one and a half hours. Oh my god, I just found out you can record it differently. Instead of being stiff like this, it will record the way I drew it too. I never knew about this before. I am a genius. Well, this text-to-speech man sure has a lot of confidence by the way he said that. I am a genius. I won't lie. I don't know what to type anymore. So have fun with the music. Alright, here it is finished. Now for the other half. Here we are now, in Procreate. I imported the images and immediately started. The other eye was kinda tough. I think what I dislike most about this project is that the colors are in the same. In the end, I tried blending them, but in my opinion, you can still tell. Maybe that's just my artist brain though. I don't know. I do really like how the shading turned out on both sides. And the lineage is okay too, but I prefer the one on the right. I won't lie. I've been playing a lot of Roblox recently, and the game Free Draw 2 is really fun in my opinion. 
I love drawing together with people, but since my friends aren't always free, I'll just go over there. The trolls can get really annoying though, so the free private servers are a real lifesaver. Alright, I yet again ran out of topics, so see you when I get any ideas what to talk about. This is where I try blending the colors together. I added some effects because I thought it looked bland. And a square background of course. And now, the finished product. Thank you guys a lot for watching. This is very different from my usual content so please feel free to leave your opinion if I should start or continue content like this and what you'd like to see from me. Also please don't forget to like and maybe even subscribe to my channel. It would mean a lot to me. See you guys in for months.